John and Lee, teams across our state are running drills and gearing up for football season. But due to low participation numbers, Cassville High School is pulling the plug on their Friday night lights. Check your splits. Ready, go. It's going to be different. The lights will not be on. Born and raised in Cassville and a longtime coach, Chad Infield has never seen a canceled varsity season before this year. That's the hardest thing that I, I feel like to take away from those kids because those are experiences that they never forget. Football is a sport that you only get to play for so long and those Friday nights are special to them. After losing 12 graduating seniors, then seeing low registration numbers followed by a few injuries, Infield says putting the small and young team on the field wouldn't be right. For safety reasons, you can't ask a kid to play every down of every play in a football game with no breaks. With no incoming seniors, the young team will continue to play, however, as a junior varsity team. I would have been, I guess, a little disappointed to not be able to play on the Friday nights or all that hype for the Friday nights, but you still get to be with your teammate and get out and play football still, so that's a positive note. Elijah Oki fondly remembers his years on the Comets football team. He even returned to join the coaching staff in 2014. Oh, hands, are hands are up, keep them going, keep them going. And has faith in the young team. That's it, Kale. Good job. Well, I just hoping that people still come out and uh, support us, uh, cheer us on, and, and make it feel like a Friday night game. Hopefully, I told them we'll get through this year, and then you can get those lights back on next year somewhere, whether it's here or somewhere else. We'll make it happen for them. The school is considering the option of working with other area schools if their numbers are still low next year. The varsity team was scheduled to kick off their season this weekend against Schulzburg in Platteville, but will instead start off on Monday as a junior varsity team.